So disappointing the defeat. What's your take on the performance today? Um, first half, we were very good. Um, we should have been in front. I thought we played some really good stuff, created chances, um, didn't take our chances. Um, went behind to a, a great finish from, from the lad, uh, to put it in the top corner. Just against a run of play. Um, but that's football, you know, if you don't if you don't take your chances, you, you always run the risk and, and them going one nil up, it, it enabled them to sit in a little bit deeper and make it hard and, you know, slow the game down and, and whatever else. And obviously second half, I don't think we played anywhere near as well second half. I thought we went um, back to front a little bit too too much and, you know, we don't, we, we haven't really got the personnel up, up top in terms of, uh, you know, Ben Harris and Elliot Benyon at the moment. and. Yeah, I just thought that you know we still created chances second half, but I guess they have as well, um, more so, more so on the break. Um, but yeah, listen, disappointing result. We just we just been in there. We're very balanced, very honest with with the players. Um, I didn't think that we deserved to lose the game, but we did. Um, and and the, the clear clear reason why we lost the game is we didn't take our chances, and and, and that's that's football. You know, you, you have to you have to take it on the chin. Um, We've played worse and won this season, and uh, yeah, we, we we just said in there, we, you know, we have to come in this week, Tuesday, Thursday, and and have a good training week and and get ready to go to Dover. Like you said, you played a very good first half. Would you say the first goal they scored was a bit of a turning point in the game? Yeah, it always is. For, you know, like this league is uh, is an extremely tough league. If it's, if a side gets in front, um, it's it's very difficult to. Sort of turn it round. We've done it a few times this season already, um, but you know, for whatever reason, we just we, we didn't take our chances, and and that's a collective. That's not just you know forward or anything like that. It's uh, you know I think we've um, you know had, I mean even even right at the end, you know George George Wells and his header that's just gone wide. You know you're expecting it to hit the back of the net. So so uh, as a team, we're guilty. Um, you know, listen, there's no. No hiding that we're, you know, obviously missing missing a uh, uh, forward. You know, we tried to bring one in this week, and that that didn't didn't happen. And you know, we've got two two experienced, excellent forwards um, sitting on the sidelines. And and where we are as a club, you know, we can't go out and just spend money and just bring somebody in. And you know, it, unfortunately, we're we're in a, in a in a sticky situation in that respect. So we have to we have to try and work with what we've got and try and identify somebody else now. And um, yeah, yeah, it's it's a it's a disappointing day because I, I felt that our performance, especially first half, warranted us to be going in at, at half time in front. But you know, you have to say fair play to them. You know, brilliant finish from um, from the lad for the first goal, and you know they kept on coming. You know, and and they they hit us on the break a number of times in the second half. Listen, we changed our shape and we went went to a three at the back and we've shoved, shoved guy up top for try and get a, a physical presence up there. Um, but it, it didn't work today, so uh, you have to say hats off to Hemel. Um, they've, they've got the three points, and they'll be delighted. You've had many chances in the first 15-20 minutes. What would you say you lacked in the offensive? Third? Was it just converting uh, the chances? Yeah, I mean, listen, their keepers pulled off a great save from Lee Togwell's header. Um, you know, on another day, he spills it out, and you know somebody smashes it in. Um, uh, Lenchy, Lenchy's header that hits a crossbar. It's a great header. Couldn't do much more. Um, falls to Johnny. Johnny puts it wide. You know he's got to hit the target. Um, you know we've had other, other other shots on goal where you know we haven't hit the target, and that's that's the key thing at the end of the day. There's, there's no disguising. Football is is very much um, um, about scoring those goals, and and it gives you momentum in the game. Um, we didn't get it today. Um, they did, and they they hung on for it, and they they, they got the three points. This week you've celebrated with John 12 years of management. This is probably not the result you wanted <laughs> today to celebrate it. No, I mean it's, it's you know it's, it's not for, for us. It's not a, um, a milestone. It's a, it's, a, it's a, a great stat. You know, there's not not too many managers that have, have been working for 12 years consistently. Um, you know, this is our almost 10th year at the club, and I think we've had a, a, a reasonable career so far. And um, but yeah, it, you know, it comes down to football results and. You, you want to win every game that you're involved. You're never going to do it, you know. Like it's it's such a tough league, and um, you know, you hear one or two disgruntled people, you know, oh that wasn't very good. Well, it, it probably wasn't second half. You know, I didn't think we were great at all second half, but you know, we, we could have been quite easily in front first half, and uh, and I don't think Hemel could have really complained if we, if we had gone in in front. But 
um, as I said, they were they were clinical with their chances in the end, and and um, I say they come away with a, with a, with a great three points from them. So, yeah, we have to we have to dust it down. We have to get in this week and and be really positive. You know, we've we've just been in now and we've been positive with the lads. You know, we're a small squad. We're only 15 today, um, and uh, yeah, we'll just uh, we'll see what we can do this this week, and we'll look forward to travelling to Dover. Next week, traveling to Dover, away game, another tough one. They won 3-0 against Brentree today. What would you take from this game, maybe onwards? I mean, yeah, it's a, it's a great win for them, that. Um, you know, they picked up some good results recently. I think um, when we were due to play them, I think they, were, they weren't in the greatest of form. And, um, you know, maybe we're going there at a bad time. Uh, obviously, Ben and Elliot aren't going to be fit. You know, we're, we're going to try and, try and do something this week, but... It's not just as simple as click your fingers and, and bring in a striker. It's it really it's really not. So we have to we have to see what we can do. Um, we will work we will work hard this week um, and we will set ourselves up at Dover. Whether that's with a new striker or, or not, we will go with what we've got and 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 we will try and go there and get three points. All right. Thank you. Very All right. Much. No problem. Cheers. Thank you. Good luck. Yeah. Thank you.